Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am going to show you all two amazing experiments. For the first experiment, you need salt, two lemons, two transparent glasses with water and any stick to mix. First, when I put the lemon into the first glass it sinks and if i put the other lemon to the second glass this also sinks but for the right one i'm going to add one spoon salt and mix And add another spoon. When I add the salt, you can see that the water comes up. Keep mixing till the salt. When you mix, I had removed the lemon because it was not properly mixing. Now I'm going to put the lemon. In the salt water you can see that the water has turned into white now as soon as i put the lemon it doesn't sink but it floats this is the normal water in which i have put the normal lemon, which is sinking but in the salt water it floats see this magic trick let me tell the reason the normal water when we put the lemon into it the lemon has more density than the water so it sinks but when we add the salt to the water the water gets more density than the lemon and the lemon starts to float this proves that the object which has more density sinks let me remove the floating lemon and put it to the normal water. See the magic trick. This also sinks. But if I again remove it. Down. Which was in the pure water and putting it in the salt water. There is nothing in the lemon, but there is a change in the water. The salt increases the water's density. This is the second, this is, was the lemon which is in the water. Now I am going to put the same lemon in the salt water. It floats. But the lemon which was floating, if I put that lemon in the pure water, it will sink. Let's move to the next experiment. This experiment you need a water bottle which has small hole on the top and a small newspaper piece which is of double layer. Now I have filled the water till the top. Now if I pour you can see that the water pours. But, see the water, it will come out. But, now I have refilled the water bottle again. Now I am taking this small tissue paper which can simply tear like this. And now I am going to keep it on the top of the bottle. You can see that it gets wet. Now slowly I am going to take it down. You can see that it starts to tear. I am going to remove the extra tissue paper. Now you can see that the tissue paper is wet. But see the magic now. The water doesn't comes out. 
Wow, it's so amazing. But when I when I even tap, it is completely leak proof. So amazing it is. This is the normal tissue paper which can easily tear in the water. But this very thin newspaper only can stop the whole water bottle from leaking. See how amazing it is. Even if I tap, it is leak proof. But even if I tap here, it is leak proof. But when I push it very hard, when the tissue paper comes out, the water starts to leak this experiment again i have refilled the glass water bottle again now when i put the tissue paper on top this gets to become transparent and slowly i'll tear the extra tissue paper and now you can see that the hole is completely covered with the tissue paper. And now, see the magic. The water does not start to leak. But when I even tap, the water does not leak. Even if I do here, doesn't leak. But if I, if I push it, the water starts to leak. Because when we push, this tissue paper comes out. The two experiments for today. Thanks for watching. Please, this is an amazing trip. If you lose the lid of the water bottle when you are going to picnic, if you have a small piece of paper, you can make a lid out of it. Thanks for watching.